Good day, grade six learners. Uh, we have learned time in the past grades, you know, the 24 hour and 12 hour annotations. You can read time, you can tell time. Uh, today we want to uh, go to, to look at the analog and digital uh, time. This is an example of an analog time. It is called an analog time because it has hands. It has a short hand and a, a long hand. Each hand points at a number. Uh, when the hand is pointing at that specific number, that is where we are picking or reading the time, the, the time from. The short hand points at the hour, like this, and the, short, the long hand points at the minute. If we're looking at this, um, you see there are some divisions here. They show seconds, but we are not going to look at the seconds now, but we are, only, we are only focusing on the long and the short. When the time is like this, this is two o'clock. That is the, the analog and uh, that, that is the, the purpose of these hands. So they show us where the time, uh, the, wh what the time is. Uh, the, the clock goes uh, from the right hand side to the left hand side. This is called clockwise. We don't have a clock that goes from left to right. It's always from right to left clockwise. Okay. Then we also have what is called the digital clock. The digital clock doesn't have hands, but it has a screen that shows digits only. For example, if it is like this, it is six o'clock. You will find more illustrations and more, more uh, problems or activities in your learner's book. 